Here's how to install Warzone for free on PC. This video is probably going to help those of you that are new to computers or those of you that are struggling to install Warzone on your computer. Now, the first thing you want to do is head over to this link. You'll find it down below in the description or you can search up on your browser callofduty.com slash Warzone. Once you're over here, you want to scroll down and then you want to select the platform where you're playing. Now, before you go ahead and click anything in here, if you already have a Steam and let me remove this from here, if you already have a Steam or the Steam launcher, you could go ahead and press a Steam in there and follow the Steam installation. But if you don't have any launcher to play Call of Duty Warzone from, then we're going to go ahead and use the Battle.net. Battle.net is their official launcher and if you were to have any issues there's probably more videos on how to fix the Battle.net game than how to fix any other game from here. So let's go ahead and choose Battle.net right here from the middle and then the download will begin for the installer of Battle.net. You'll find this installer on your recent download history right here on the top or in the downloads folder of your computer and what I want you to do is go ahead and drag and drop this file into your desktop. Again you can find it in your default downloads folder. Once you have this file in your desktop go ahead and double click on it and then you'll get this little installer in here of course select the language that you want to use for your game and then hit continue right here. Now after you press continue you might get a little prompt asking you to allow this app to run that's an admin prompt just go ahead and allow it and then just wait for this to update now after a couple seconds you're going to get this installer right here and you could change the install location of your launcher this is not the install location of the game this is only the launcher for battle.net i'm going to install it on my c drive but feel free to change that to whatever you want and then i'm going to disable this right here and i also recommend you guys disable it because it could get really annoying that every time you turn on your computer battle.net opens and then go ahead and hit continue now just wait for this to install now once battle.net has installed in your computer it's going to open automatically like this and all you have to do here is log in you could create a new account if you don't have one right here or you could even log in with one of these accounts in here you have a lot of different options so i'm gonna go ahead and log in with my account because i already have one now after you log in you're gonna get this in here where you could review the terms of course and if you agree you're gonna hit agree and then battle.net is going to scan for games in your computer it's probably not going to find any it's okay just go ahead and hit done now once you're here what you want to do is head over to games right here and then you want to select where it says a star for free right here on the left side because again we're installing this completely for free and then you want to select call of duty right here and if you don't see it right here you could always search for it in the shop you should see it right here go ahead and select it that is going to put you right here and what you want to do is go ahead and hit where it says install and once you hit install it's going to put you right here make sure you select the folder that has enough space for your game to be installed as you can see it's a very heavy game and something i'm going to do is disable auto updates because i like to be in control of when my games update and if you want your games to be updated automatically just go ahead and enable that but i'm going to keep it unchecked and then once you're set with your settings click on continue and now in here you could go ahead and uncheck black ops 6 you don't need to install that and then just make sure that you have selected warzone 2022 as well as Warzone. Now, if for whatever reason you don't have enough space to install all of this, you could always uncheck Warzone 2022 and just install Warzone, but you might not have access to everything. If you want to have free access to everything, you also want to install Warzone 2022. And then once you have those two selected, Warzone 2022 as well as Warzone, go ahead and press start install. And now the installation will begin. You just have to wait a couple seconds or a couple minutes for this to be installed. And then once Warzone has finished install, guys, you will see the play button right here. And then you could just go ahead and hit play and start enjoying Call of Duty. And now you guys should be able to play Warzone without any issues completely for free. If this video helped you all, don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you guys next time.